Welcome to Malawi, a small country known as the warm heart of Africa. But did you know Malawi means flaming water or tongues of fire? This fiery name hails from the sun's reflection on Lake Malawi, painting an image of dancing flames across its surface. And speaking of the lake, it's not just a pretty sight. Lake Malawi is one of the largest lakes in the world, home to over 500 species of fish. So Malawi isn't just warm-hearted, it's also a fiery spectacle. Lake Malawi isn't just known for its fiery reflections, it's also a calendar in its own right. Remarkably, this body of water measures 365 miles long and 52 miles wide, matching the number of days and weeks in a calendar year. This unique feature is more than a geographical curiosity. It also underscores the lake's importance to Malawi's economy and ecosystem. So, you see, Lake Malawi isn't just a body of water, it's a living, breathing calendar. Malawi isn't just about lakes and flames, it's also home to a superfood that could save millions of lives. The baobab fruit, grown in abundance in Malawi, is a powerhouse of nutrients. This humble fruit is loaded with high amounts of vitamin C, surpassing the content found in many common fruits. With its potential to combat malnutrition across Africa, the baobab fruit holds a promise of health and vitality. In Malawi, health doesn't just grow on trees, it hangs from them in the form of baobab fruit. In Malawi, women are more than just homemakers. They're the backbone of the country's economy. With their hands firmly planted in the soil, these hard-working women make up over 70% of the agricultural workforce. They're not just feeding their families, they're feeding the nation. Their tireless efforts in food production significantly contribute to the nation's gross domestic product, driving the Malawian economy forward. In Malawi, women aren't just women, they're the pillars of economic growth. Malawi is a country full of surprises. But perhaps the most surprising is the story of William Kamkwamba. This tale of resilience and ingenuity begins in a small Malawian village where a young boy named William had a vision. Amidst poverty and a lack of resources, William saw potential in the scrap materials around him. He assembled a windmill, a beacon of hope that would generate electricity for his village. This was a game changer, an act that sparked light in a place where darkness was the norm. His story resonated far beyond the boundaries of his village, inspiring millions around the world. It became a best-selling book, The Boy Who Harnessed the Wind. William Kamkwamba proved that miracles are made of determination, creativity, and the will to change the world, no matter where you come from. In Malawi, miracles aren't just stories of the past, they're living, breathing realities of the present.